Hey, hey, this is Nereon, and welcome to a brand new episode of the Dark Pictures Anthology, Little Hope. And joining us today, once again, is Mycelial Matt. I need a break. We gotta keep moving. Can't stop. No, wait. He needs a break. Forget it. Those things are coming after us, not you. We can't hang around. None of us is safe. Not tonight. All right. What's our next move? I'm not sure. We should rest here for a while. Yeah. In the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Let's rest here in this dirt path. You asleep? That's impressive. I wish. No way I could get any shut eye after what went down tonight. Would love to, though. I'm beat. Any ideas how we're getting out of here? Fog has us surrounded. There's no way through. We can't just do nothing. We need to figure out where the fog is coming from. I think the kid, Mary, is the key to finding a way through it. Getting to Mary, stopping her, might help. Sure, okay, but what about the other kid? The one that keeps running from us? Mary and her are connected somehow, I'm sure of it. Maybe the other girl is trying to lead us somewhere. Where? I don't know. Maybe to a place we can stop all this. Stopping that kid is our best shot. But how? Not even sure she's real. What's the big plan? Please, little girl, will you stop messing with us? We have to try. We owe it to the others. And ourselves. Mary's the key to this. I'm certain of it. You're right. When we stop her, this all goes away. If we see her again, nothing here is certain. <sighs> oh, what's going on? You okay? My eyes were just burning for a second there. It's okay, I'm good now. That's what happens when you rest. What's that? Shh, shh, shh. Hell no, that thing is back to finish me off. Get down. Everything, Take cover. Everything's about Taylor. It's heading straight for us. Be quiet. Oh, we're gonna do some heartbeat shit now. Angela! Holy moly. Easy, Tiger. I'm a little tender. I thought you were gone. How in the hell did you find us? We thought, you know, we're all glad you made it. Stop it. You're going to make me blush. But thank you. No one messes with you. For sure. You are one tough lady. So the whole crew is back together. You rounded everyone up. Good job. Mm, not quite. They found us. Right now, our priority is getting you safe. Let's go. I can't believe Angela's alive. We've come across more of those things since you left. I'm us. more disappointed at make us play through some awful pulse pounding now sewer Now you're telling level. me there's more of them? What in God's name are they? Mm. Oh, uh, I almost forgot I had these. Very happy to return them. There was a time I feared it wouldn't happen. Thanks. You're a true gentleman. Ugh. 
One lens is broken. Maybe I'll break the other one, then I won't have to see what's going on down here. Not sure that's gonna give us the edge we're looking for, but I like the idea. You hear that? I heard it. Sounded close, too. Just gotta keep moving. Get ready. I really can't believe we're all back together as a full group. <laughs> uh, it seems kind of cheap that Angela just showed up. It kind of makes me suspicious. Like, is that Angela? Let me help you down. Yeah. Seeing as neither of us got to play as her when she disappeared. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <clears throat> like, I was dreading like, which one of us was going to have her. Play through her. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was scary. Hold up! Andrew, wait! Oh, God. 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 He's gonna have a heart attack or something. Oh, watch. Quick time, quick time. Shit! Wait up! I tr I try to give you a heads up. Keep moving, go! It's too fast for the mouse. I think I do need to switch. Doesn't matter. We have to keep moving. Let's do it right now then. It's just the quick time. Yeah, and there's going to be some right now, so. Uh, Please wait during this brief. Brief something. My brain's not working. <laughs> Intermission. <laughs> you got it? Yeah, I guess. You changed it to keyboard and mouse? Yeah. Oh. Not happy about it. Oh. But it is too hard to do the quick time. <laughs> oh, quick now time. I don't know what it's going to make me press. Easy. W A S D usually. It got me to press A, but it could be different for you. I got gotcha. you. Come on. Oh. oh. Gotcha. It was for me. Andrew? You there? Daniel? Don't. Taylor? Don't, don't, don't go separate ways. Oh my god. What's wrong with these people? You gotta wait for me to save the girl. And then I can save her. Oh no! The professor's got your back. <laughs> With the same move you had last time. Rock to the back of the head. <laughs> Angela was like spared of all that. Because I think she's one of the monsters. Or uh, her monster didn't show up. Her monster's the drowned one. Oh, hey, everybody. I'm fine. You okay? How we got out of there in one piece, I'll never know. Hold the celebrations. We're still cornered in shithole central. And the fucking mutants are still out there. We gotta keep moving. <sighs> huh, still stuck. What is this scene? What is going on? Are you seeing this too? It's just the brush and like, I think the bosses got stuck. Yeah. Yeah. It is better to conquer yourself than to win a thousand battles. Then the victory is yours. It cannot be taken from you. Not by angels or by demons. Heaven or hell. 
Perhaps you've started to realize something. Everyone's dead already. <laughs> a smug look on his face. <laughs> Everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. Three executions, three tormented beings, and not a soul lost. You're doing very well. Keep it up. Any thoughts on what might be around the corner, hidden by the fog? Something wicked this way comes. Well, he's confirmed that everyone's alive. <laughs> yes. Or a soul. Okay. Although he says souls not lost. So. Yeah. Keep a lookout for the girl. We have to stop her. I, for one, hope I never see that girl ever again. Stopping that kid is the only way we're making it out of here. Keep your eyes. There's your something side. behind us as well. There's. Oh. I can't interact with this sign. There was another path back there. I don't want to miss anything. Well, I've got Angela and Taylor with me. I've got the professor over here. Is that a dead end down there or? No, it's wide open. There's just multiple trails. This may sound crazy, just want to explore them all. I don't know if it goes if in a big loop or not. Saving our doubles it might. from execution is fireflies. That's what's causing the glow. Ooh. Fireflies. Looks kind of beautiful, don't you think? Kind of weird looking. No one's tended to uh, Daniel's wound, which is kind of funny. Flashback. <gasps> no, this cannot be. My own eyes deceive me. My apologies for the lateness of the hour, but I must speak with you. What ails you, my friend? It is Mary. I am troubled by her, by the part she has played in these trials. Those trials trouble us all. There is more to this. I saw her smile as her own sister was executed. She took pleasure from it. Are you certain? I am. But now that she speaks of guilt and remorse, it is hard not to believe her. Keep away from her, Abraham. No good can come from being with that child. Too late. With her brother and sister gone, Mary now lives under my roof. Your charity places you in grave danger. What do you advise? Tell the court you suspect she toys with us all. That you saw her delight in her own sister's death. I implore you. I am torn. Mary seems full of Keep remorse. Your suspicions to yourself, and it's our community which will suffer. None of us is safe from her wild imaginings. Very well. If the court will listen, I will speak. It's interesting how, like, all the um, past characters have their names start with the same letter. Like Abraham, Andrew. I am bewitched. You're not bewitched. How else can your presence be explained? I, I can't explain this, but you're not. She has conjured you to defend her. To press me into silence. Only the devil could create a demon who so resembles me. I'm not a demon. But we do look alike, which I agree is pretty damn weird. What do you want from me? I want to know what you're going to say to the court. About Mary. I was decided to speak to the court. Now I'm not so sure. You think she's a victim? Or not? What do you think, Matt? She might be, pos she might be possessed, yeah. Or she's... Or she's I don't know. Or she's know just... this must look. Awful and sadistic. Hmm. Tell everyone what the girl did. Like your friend is telling you to. The devil has sent you to tempt me. I must not succumb. Little Hope is no longer the town I knew. Strange and disturbing events have become commonplace. You, whatever you are, are but one of these. 
Revealing the truth about Mary may save my friend, but it does not sit easily with me that in doing so I condemn a child. Mm, whatever you say, he seems to do the Putting opposite. Putting it all on a kid isn't right. The priest is the one driving this whole thing. Get the fuck out of here! You've been itching to stop this kid no matter what. Now you want to go all bleeding hard on us? Reverend Carver is a man guided by God. No one can doubt that. See, Andrew just completely won thought, it hated. Well, no, I, I chose that because I thought maybe it would ease him into making the decision that we wanted Bad him to move make. there, man. Standing up for the kid is probably going to do us all in. I hope you're wrong. For all our sakes. The thing is, whatever I chose, he what didn't happened? believe what I said and went, you get a chance wanted to, to do the opposite. Mary? No. We never even saw her. Fuck. Because he thinks you're some kind of demon trying to tempt him, right? So he's going to always think whatever you're telling him to do is the wrong thing. Possibly. Yeah, well. The other option was he just to be like, yeah, the kid's bad. Abraham. Or nothing. He was thinking about testifying against Mary, but good boy Andrew talked him out of it. That was a smart move. Are you fucking kidding me? We are seeing glimpses of what happened here hundreds of years ago. How you doing? Ago. Not great. Demons from the past? Don't know how much more of this shit I can take. One thing That's I didn't reason. see coming, well, I feel like one of the team. No sense. I'm good with that. It never happens to me. Yeah, I hear that. Learned a few things about myself tonight. Shame it had to be from witches and ghosts. We could have used one of those, uh, what do you call it? A paladin, a holy warrior. <laughs> holy shit. I never had you down as a game geek. There's a lot more about me you don't know. I'm full of surprises. Oh. You'll see. Surprise one, I have a penis. We need to get moving. <laughs> Fuck this place and this stupid ass crash that got us here. Oh no, Taylor, behind you. Where did you go? Taylor! Where are you? Taylor! Taylor, I'm coming! Uh, I'm doing my best Shit. here, but they are being Stupid very aggressive deer. about killing me. I made the wrong choice. Oh. Pretty good. Oh, I'm dead. Did you have quick time events? I I nailed all of them. I had two options. I could follow sound or follow movement, and something was moving, so I followed movement. Um, as the thing killed me, it went into its eyes, and it had a lock symbol on aggressive and deceitful. So I guess I'm not aggressive or deceitful, and because of that I die. I can't believe Taylor's gone. I'm sorry. What the fuck? We need no. to get away from here. On the plus side, quick Let's time has become out. easy. It'll get us out of these damn woods, and we can talk on the way. Mine wasn't a quick time again, it was just a choice of what, what to follow. And I chose wrong. But like I said, I feel like everyone's already dead. Like, that's... I'm just, the, the more the story progresses and how they feel like they recognized the girl before, and... So hold on. If I go to collections and characters, I can't go to the other ones. But I can see here on my screen, like, arrogant is locked. He's amiable, uncertain, sympathetic, and now he's not arrogant. 
which you would think is a good thing, but I guess maybe if you unlock all the personality traits through your choices, it's somehow better. Oh yeah, you can choose. Well, I've got Andrew, and he's compassionate, anxious, and altruistic. He's not fearful. That's locked. Potentially curious, potentially optimistic. Yeah. I'm ready to continue. I'm sorry. I think. So yeah, if I, if her, her, her deceitful and aggressive, but those aren't great traits to have, so I don't understand. Oh. Had I made the right choice, I probably would have been able to save you. Taylor. I just can't believe it. This ain't happening. I am sorry for letting you die. I think I let me die by not making the... Or we did not... Uh, oh, what's that? Build Taylor up the right way. I don't know. There's... Is there anything of interest there or no? It's a stickman figure. Oh. Well. It should stick around. Uh -huh. You hear that sound? You coming or not? Can't believe Taylor's gone. I'm such a fucking asshole. I could have saved her. We all knew she was in danger and we all let her down. Those things, whatever the hell they are, are relentless. How could anyone stop them? The only way out of this freaking nightmare is to stop Mary, stop her lying. You had a chance to get Mary exposed for what she is, a liar and a faker. Put her in the dock for a change. Why didn't you take it? We don't know for sure that stopping Mary will help us out. It's just a theory. It may only be a theory, but right now it's all we've got. This is a one-shot deal. We get it wrong, and there's no replay. It's game over, so I'm up for doing whatever it takes. Game over, man. <laughs> Let's take a look. It's game over. That's <laughs> tired. Time for a trip. All right. Uh Ooh, gnarly. Oh, let me have a look. Oh, yeah, you're going to want to see that. Gnarly. Gnarly, dude. Dude. All right. Oh. Oh, John. Let him get in the headlock. Well, I'm not too upset about that. <laughs> I mean, John's a bit flaky sometimes, right? One minute he's like very decisive, and then he's a little bit, yeah. What if? Uh, I don't know. What if they are dead, and this is their purgatory to try and reconcile their shortcomings, and unlocking all those personality traits is what we're supposed to do, and that's why she died, not because of anything else, but because I or we never got Taylor to be deceitful or aggressive or to you know, stop being as such. I don't know. Hmm. Check this out. It's a door. It's a... <laughs> I was going to say that. <laughs> Check this out. Seems to be some kind of door. <laughs> oh, it hey! seems like... See, now that dude I just don't trust. He's like the guy to the afterlife. I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. Come on. Inside. Why don't we just talk to him? The only thing that's not tried to murder us.
Can you imagine, like, the one way out of here is that guy and we're just ignoring well, him all the time? No one's been here for a long time. <laughs> now is my time to speak before the judge. I am filled with dread. I cannot know how my testimony will be received. The devil has blinded so many to what is real and what is not. Nothing good will come of this. His words will seek to twist the truth. Allow me to judge what is true. Abraham and Joseph are allies in this deception. And lest we forget, you condemned Joseph to death only yesterday. Or do you now question that decision? I have heard nothing today to sway my conviction. Joseph consorted with the same malicious force as his wife. For this, the court thanks Reverend Carver, who faced the devil's wrath to present the evidence. It is only my duty, Judge. Now, however, this court is duty-bound by law to seek out the truth. We must therefore examine these claims made by Abraham against Mary. If I may speak briefly, Judge Wyman. Time is short, Reverend. Be indeed brief. Mary has shown great fortitude to speak out against the evil here. Many would have lacked her courage. Yet her reward for exposing this brooding covered in our midst is to be besmirched. Her courage is not in question. It is her intent we must be certain of. Her accuser is the very man entrusted to care for this innocent child. Plain to see, he is not fit for such a task. And I would ask the court to have Mary placed elsewhere. Who would you have be her new ward, Reverend? I am prepared to take responsibility for the child. If the court agrees. First, the court must hear what Abraham has to say. No decision can be made on the child until then. Abraham! What am I to do? Some would have me speak out against Mary, but could a child truly be capable of such evil? Oh, what do we think? Hmm. Are you for real? The kid is guilty as hell! Just... You must do what you believe is right. Tell the court what you have come here to say. Speak up, boy. Out with it! Mary has spoken of evil spirits, devilry and witchcraft. Things many cannot believe could exist here in the I'm not here for history and hearsay. Get to the point, boy. Mary is tormented. The apparitions she has seen, they have plagued her. Stolen her innocence. Some suggest she is in league with these creatures, but no one can be certain. Myself, least of all. Can any of us truly know a child's mind? You claim I lack the ability to see the truth. I beg forgiveness. I would never suggest such a thing. My time is not for wasting. You and the priest have irked me enough for one day. I have more to say. I have already given you enough time. Okay. Furthermore, Mary is to be placed into the care of Reverend Carver. Now stand down. Guy takes too long to say say something so short. <laughs>